I think we're doing Chris Kringle, right? Next yeah, I think we're gonna just knock out All Christmas right. games. So, uh, now that we've done that, we got an hour to play whatever, really. Yeah. So, I guess this so is... So, there we have it. Brett is the... So the new... Start doing the interviews now? <laughs> is the new champion of, uh... Defeating the most games in one night, toppling eight. That's the most games we've beaten in one night. Yeah, that was actually the most games we've beaten one night. And actually, we've beaten nine, because Jesse did Darkwing Duck. Yeah, I think before that, the the highest was, uh... <laughs> Jesse, <laughs> Jesse wants to know if you want to do Lolo 2. I don't know, what you would rather do? You want to do the I Christmas? I think Christmas. <laughs> I'm kind of on the Christmas thing, yeah. too, just because it's... The, you know, we're not going to be here next week because of Christmas. Yeah. It's a Christmas season. Let's play some Christmas games. Fuck Lolo! <laughs> Fuck Lolo! <laughs> Uh, yeah, we're not going to do half. Lolo. Jesus. Though. Really? Is it that long? Oh, my God. If Lolo was the son of God, we would play it. But since... <laughs> All right, we're going to play, uh, I guess we do this, uh, Recringled Super Mario Xmas, the limited red edition. Super rare. Ten Ooh. of ten. Once it clicks up. Christmas Mario time. Oh, well, it is ten of ten. Here, you can show it on the box. Uh, I'll make this up real quick. All right, we're doing Christmas Mario, and we got an hour, so shouldn't we? Mine, uh, mine. Sh should it, should we play all the levels like just straight through? <laughs> is, it, is it a straight Mario game? Though? I don't know. If it's a straight Mario clone, then I don't know. We should be able to. <laughs> we should be okay, able to do it. No, oh, this is different, yeah. It's even got <laughs> new music and everything. He didn't change anything. Okay, so we can't break the ice. Yes, all, no, all levels, yes. no Okay, warps. Jesse says yes, all levels, no warps. Which, given that this isn't exactly a clone exactly, we probably wouldn't know where the warps were anyway. That's the uh, Tetris music. That's what that is. Yeah, this isn't even Christmas music. I guess <laughs> that's the fireworks. It's got snowmen. That like guy has two balls up there. Yeah. They did really well on the Santa, though. What the hell is what? that? It's an ornament. Oh, oh man, what a shitty shot! Look at that! Oh, that sucks. Look, they all got nightcaps on. Oh, that sucks. That's like, that's like two bricks range. Ironic that after all the money is racked up, but they turn into wrapped gifts, the blocks do. Oh, holy crap, look at that! Jeez. Oh, that sucks. Yeah! I don't know, that thing doesn't put up with your shit. Oh, wow, look at that. It's not, let, it's not letting Daniel up anywhere. The frig? I like how all of them look like, like, grungy sewers. Yeah. No warps! <laughs> That's true. Dude, minus one! Yeah. And now we're back to Tetris. Oh, no. Maybe we should, like... Yeah. Oh, my God. 
Just the other day, I was watching Santa Claus Conquers the Martians. Oh. Oh, yeah. I don't care. We don't care about the info. I'm so behind on this. I just want to see if Spot... Fly, oh, there's a Santa. This is... I mean, a Santa. A uh, snowman. <laughs> Twerking. Just put NBC. It's not gonna fit in there. Oh! Why don't you take a hit? Shut up and play. Oh, jeez, what is this? You have to run and then jump. Oh, that's the trampoline! Yeah, but what are you, what are you jumping over? <laughs> oh, Santa with Muscles, that's a great movie! Hawk Hogan is <laughs> saving the orphanage! <laughs> oh, man! It's that delay! <laughs> Santa with muzzle oh man, that is such a great show. Christmas is over! Christmas is over! Christmas is cancelled! My turn! <laughs> Alright, John Michael's gonna give it a shot. Christmas is cancelled! <laughs> oh, I can hold back! No, sorry. Oh man. Oh my god. Where are you, Blind Lemon Ford? Where are you, sir? Yeah, there's a good uh, plethora of really bad uh, Christmas movies. The remake of, or the sequel of uh, Christmas Story that came out a couple years ago was, was notoriously bad. <laughs> I ain't watching that shit. Yeah. Someone just told me that Home Alone's an overrated movie, and I told them you're now unfriended. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 awesome. Great, that's a classic. One and two are both really good movies. Is John Michael on the same level as me? It changed levels? Oh, weird. He is a level 1-1, one, one, yeah. He says 1-1, one, one, though. Wow. Well, you know what, though? You went through that pipe. Oh, that's you right, yeah. all that. Yeah, well, this is a custom hack, so... What happened on my phone? Shitty snowballs. Weird, I'm getting weird service back here. I know. Yeah, those snowballs are... <laughs> yeah, caca. Weird music, too. Yeah. Ooh. They purposely designed this level so you can't get on top. <laughs> Except for right there. I think there's a warp in there. I doubt there is. John Michael going for the minus one. Going for the minus one. Oh, I hit the wrong one. Who was the first guy to figure that shit out? Like, right. No Christmas this year yet. Sorry, Neon. Game Genie codes on this? <laughs> we had to go get a Game Genie to do it. Yeah, there's a couple here. Oh my god, those Game Genie Smoop Marvels are pretty, those are pretty fun. But every single enemy throws a hammer yeah, at you. Yeah, that was oh, horrible. that was hilarious. Some of the more, it's actually one of the easiest games to manipulate with the Game Genie, too. Cause it's it is. Simple, yeah. Any of the black box games, you can do some crazy stuff. I think, like, one, one of them is, like, for pinball, gives you, like, five balls. Oh, jeez. Yeah, it's, like, ridiculous. There's gotta be secrets in here. Come on, where are the secrets? 
<laughs> you actually run faster than the fireballs. That's awesome. Oh, that sucks. Here's that... Here's that jump. How are you gonna make that? John Michael's trying a different approach. Hey, he's got... <laughs> <laughs> what a crock of shit. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> this is canceled, kids! <laughs> oh, God. Not a lot of extra men in this game. No, oh, no, it's just... That does nothing for you. It's like he almost jumps over the pole, which is actually possible in, I think, level 6 of the original Super Mario Brothers. 6-3, I think, they did find out. Alright, John Michael advancing to the first stage of Bowser Claus? Who knows? Yeah. <laughs> We're gonna find out. yeah, Ernest Saves Christmas, that's a good, that's a good classic. Ernest Saves, oh my god, I forgot about that one. Did you hear they colorized It's the One for Life? Yeah. Why would you do that? They're making a sequel of that. Aw, oh, don't. Leave it alone. That's as it, if it's even worse. You can't even touch that movie. It's like a Christmas... I, I know people have never seen it, and when they did see it, they were like crying afterwards. Like, oh my god, this is such an amount It's a really good movie. And that Christmas story, of course, uh, of course everyone likes National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation. Yeah. That one's like, I love Jingle All The Way, just for Schwarzenegger. Oh, yeah. Who told you you can eat my cookies? Put that cookie down! <laughs> I lose my shit when I see that. <laughs> I don't know why, to this day, that scene makes me fucking tear up and die. I know it's coming, but... Oh! oh. You, John Michael, put that cookie down! <laughs> Christmas is canned! Who's gonna go get it? Someone else will go get it. John Michael's taking round two. He's pissed. I'm guessing Jesse got this from a Nintendo age or maybe Retro Zone. Yeah. I think Retro USA. I still love the uh, Rankin Bass Stop Frame Animation. Uh, they gave you an instruction uh, booklet. 10 out of 10. This is super rare. They, did they only make 10? This still means absolutely nothing. So <laughs> people I think the Nintendo exam this item ensures quality, this cannot be further from the truth. No guarantee is being offered here if anything bad happens is on you. Good luck, I heard this game was hard. <laughs> <laughs> Unofficial NES City City Seal. That is hysterical. Oh my god. The up, it says question mark, question mark, question mark. Does the up do anything? Wow, so he only made ten limited editions. Oh, it's a top? snowflake he gets. Yeah. I, I like how you can't tell the difference between... They actually made, like, a, a decent, like, quality, like... It's a full-color, like, explanation of the game, which is actually really awesome. I kind of want to copy this now to hand out to people just to, just to fuck with them. Oh, he's got to fight the Grinch! That's who that is. Ah, the old Grinch. So if we can get to... Bowser. The Bowser, a a.k.a. the Grinch. This is like, uh, this reminds me of, uh... The, uh, Japanese Super Mario Bros. 2. That was deemed too difficult for American audiences, so they never released it. Until the Lost Worlds on the Super Nintendo. Tetris music makes no damn sense, but it doesn't really matter. Cause Christmas. It's Merry Christmas time, everybody. There are only ten limited edition copies, it's not retro USB. Wow. So if you look at it this way, there's more copies of stadium events and the Nintendo World Championship cart than there are of that game. Jesse has friends in the black market. He does evil deals to yeah. sell children's tears from the 80s he collected, and they got Atari Jaguar and uh, Links for Christmas. That's <laughs> why so he yeah. finds this stuff. All right, here's, pretty, here's that lovely Pretty job. awesome there. They, they just knew this game was going to be a bitch. Yeah. No continues, no one-ups, nothing. I know! Like, I haven't... There's no one-ups in this game. Yet. That we know and of. And we haven't, we haven't managed to collect a hundred ornaments enough to find out if we uh, get an extra man at that. They haven't given you a whole lot either. No, there's not. This game's a bitch!
It's all right. You're invisible. Go. Oh! oh. I love how they make you Big Mario, too, or Big yeah. Santa. John Leonard Floyd says, Christmas is canceled, kids. That's right. You little ungrateful shits. Your goddamn iPads and your <laughs> goddamn Xbox Ones. That's what happens on a year without a Santa Claus. They said, Christmas is going to be canceled. <laughs> no, no, that was actually a Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. There's nothing I can do. Oh, look at this Lost World bullshit. This yeah. <laughs> Blind Lemon Fortnite have actually gone through every single stage of, of Mario Bros. The Lost Levels. Every single one. Even if you go through 1 through 9, you get the A, B, C, and D stages. Yeah. And we beat the game. It took us like 9 hours to do it when to kill ourselves. Yeah, I've... I've got that on the Super Nintendo, and I am uh, where my guy is uh, at right now is on the second last stage of I think level nine. And I just could not. There's like a jump. Yeah, I know. So yeah, yeah. We spent like two hours just doing that. Like we literally. Here we go. Here's the Grinch, everybody. That's what the what hell? What the hell is that? Like Sonic. It looks like Sonic. Oh, that's hysterical. <laughs> they killed <laughs> Sonic! They killed yeah. Sonic! Hey, he's still giving you the double fingers, the double middle fingers of Toad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Still well, need rescuing. That's hysterical. Are you it's Christmas time. Alright, this might spell something here. Or no, not, it no. doesn't. Yeah, we we were playing the, the lot. We like we sat down. We got a bunch of pizza and Tina's frozen burritos, <laughs> which is what we used to eat all the time when we were in college. Because I think it was like uh, three burritos. It was like four burritos for a dollar. Oh God! So we were, and if, if you got like they had some special deal. If you got eight burritos, they throw an extra two for free or something. Oh jeez! We just yeah, they were disgusting. <laughs> we, live off, we had a bunch of those and pizza and all kinds of bad food. And what we ended up doing was um, we were both like, you know what we should do is we just sit down and play games all night. And the first thing we fired up was the Lost Loves is a goof. Yeah. And then like nine hours later, no sleep, like, we gotta do it, we're on level D, we gotta keep going. Oh! <laughs> oh! Fight me! Fight me! John Michael has found a new rage. <laughs> Try going above it! Nope, can't do it. Alright! <laughs> John Michael picking up his candy cane. With the Tetris music. You're just 20 ornaments away from an extra man. I think. I thought those were bombs. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Come on, seven more ornaments to an extra man. Because <laughs> otherwise you're about to die. Here you go. Yeah, yeah. extra man. What is that he's supposed to be jumping on? I don't know. Like a giant scrotum. Yeah. Or like a, I, said, so I said earlier, an uncircumcised dick. I'm like, hey, Merry Christmas. <laughs> the Jewish edition. That's <laughs> like when, we, when Brett was playing Where's Waldo. There's a bunch of little dicks drawn all around the level. Oh, oh baby. That is so specific of a jump. It is. That's like the type of jump you see on like the speed runs and stuff. I think you have to get a bunch of ornaments in this game to progress. Yeah, it, it's not too bad at Reed's There's a slight delay in the controls, but I guess it's because of the ice levels. Oh, shit, John Michael, right. Oh, you're fine, man. He's all, all freaking out, like, oh, God! When we hear that speed-up sound, we all, everything in our inner game was like, run! Run! <laughs> Just go! <laughs> See you night, beloved slacker. See you in two weeks. Remember, we're not going to be here next week, so take care, man. Have a Merry Christmas, too. Did they, did they hand out the t-shirt yet? Whoever won? Yeah, they, uh, oh. Beloved Slacker got it. I Beloved Slacker got it? Went with the Genesis themed one. What the hell is that? Whoa, jeez. I don't know what music that is. That's just weird. Man, these guys weren't messing around when they made this. Oh, oh! John Michael just getting by. Good reflexes there. All right, now he's on to World Two. Will we see the Grinch this time? 
Oh. Spooey Vision has returned! You just missed it, Spooey. We all got naked and covered ourselves in cocoa butter and eggnog. Good times. Good times. Oh! This is the inside of the castle, right? Oh, oh look at that shit! Look at that! Wow. Oh! oh! Just! Just! <laughs> John Michael, <laughs> earning his name on Team Rage, earning his blood pressure level. That's why we keep whining around. He's a certified nurse. He can help us and get us awesome drugs. There we go. Oh, <laughs> God, you got oh, so close. Like you got to keep speed jumping. Xmas is... Yeah, uh, John Michael says, screw Christmas. Is it, where did everybody else go? We still got time, right? What time is it? No, we got a half hour still. Well, Je I don't know if Jesse wants to keep playing this or not. In terms of the Xmas theme. What other? Did they play the other? Yeah, they play everything else. Oh, uh, okay. So I was thinking. Uh. Jesse, John, Michael wants to know if we can switch over to Let's Flip the Sky versus the Christmas Xmas thing for frustration levels. Actually, let me try one more time on the Christmas thing real quick while he's doing that. You can go over here and I'll play with I'm gonna step off here for a second. I gotta use the restroom. Through this game, I hundred times over. This game, this game is just stupid. I mean, it's basically one of those, uh, one of those games you need to memorize in order to play it properly. Not as bad as I want to be. Oh, he says do whatever you guys want. Right. <laughs> Tis the season to suck it. Yeah, at least let's do that. What? Uh, oh boy. Hope Daniel rages as much as you did. <laughs> I hope he does. All right, everybody. We're going to show you all something that has been in the works and is going to continue being in the works here. Um, Michael, do you want to do you want the second headset for a moment? Let him he's going to talk about this too. Uh, so Stephen Other, who you've seen commentating often for Brett, Crash Adams here, who you've seen play a game or two, and myself. I've been working on uh, something for the arcade that's going to be sold through here. It's like going to be an action figure. It was drawn and totally conceived the design of it by Stephen Other. Which and then it the okay. Oh, yeah. Got gotcha. you. So oh, good idea. Uh, it was drawn by Stephen. It was 3D modeled by uh, Michael here, and then Michael and I are going to be making the cast cast resins of it. Oh shit! Oh, you can see it oh, shit. right here. Let the camera focus. <laughs> he just died. We, we we just saw like a half. We just saw we just saw a half hour of that fucking hack. I think we can handle a few minutes off of it. It's a it's a fucking Mario hack. We can handle a moment, gentlemen. Thank you, Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> Jesus Christ. So there it is, the Arcade Monster. Uh, it's got some arms in here too that are going to be connected to it. This is a 3D print that uh, Michael sculpted and had printed on Shapeways, courtesy of Jesse. Um, it's going to have like some teeth that go in here. Michael and I are going to put it together. It's got some pieces right here that are going to be added to it, and uh, it's going to be sold here through the arcade. You can see it says like Arcade Legacy at the top there, and it's got the A in the circle. Uh, that was drawn by Stephen Other, who was around here somewhere. Yeah, he's. And uh, it's going to be awesome. It's going to come in different colors, and there's going to be, like, different prints of it. I think Jesse might be taking pre-orders, and anyone who does the pre-order is going to get, like, a... Uh, uh, it's probably going to be, like, a red metallic sheen to it, which is going to be a little more special than the We've other ones. Debating yeah, we're still debating on it. But 
We're really proud of it because it's done totally here in-house, completely, uh, except for having it printed by another company. But the whole design and the make of the things is going to be done all by us. Everyone that you see here on Be to Die Trying. So we're really looking forward to it. Uh, we need a couple more tools. I think I need a vacuum pump before we can get started mass producing them. So it might not be ready by Christmas, but look for it sometime in January. It'll be sold here through the arcade. It's hopefully the first of uh, some more to come, and uh, we're really excited to it. Yeah. I'm if hoping to be able to bring them to conventions soon. Yeah, right. Michael's going to be bringing them around to some conventions. There's like a big expo coming up uh, in Louisville in a few months. I'm sure that we're going to have them there, and it's going to be awesome. And we're really proud of it. other stuff, too. Yeah, and yeah, and they'll be not just. That's designed for white commentary. You and your face still prep. It's Mario. You have one job. That was not Mario. That was. I was working in projection tonight, man. Uh, coming up next is what cart did you just hand them? Flip the sky. I'm asking how much that they are. How much are they? Oh, uh, probably. I've heard a couple of prices. One reliable one I heard was about twenty-five. Yeah, but I, but I can't. I'm not in charge of that. Probably gonna be about twenty-five dollars, I think. Um, but it wouldn't be that far from from that. Right, somewhere in that neighborhood. They're not, they're not in the game anymore. They're not paying attention. All right, I'm gonna hand it off because I actually got to get out of here tonight. I gotta wake up very early tomorrow. Can't stay late. All right, everybody. Oh. Yeah, I gotta go. Man. I Thanks, John. Mark. Is anybody still on the, the stream? We're doing. Oh, yeah, yeah. That way, that way everybody can see Yeah, I'm going to try and beat this once and for all. You can tell everyone to buy you. Yeah. <laughs> is he going to do it? <laughs> um, the final version is going to be made out of a, uh, a hard plastic resin. It's essentially what hard hats are made out of. Um... It's pretty tough stuff. Uh, we normally have samples of, of it sitting around. I've taken them to game development um, conventions and expos b before. But uh, it shouldn't break if it gets shipped. No, uh, we, we had this shipped to us um, from a 3D printing company in Buffalo to Ohio. And it, it it handled the trip very well. And it's a lot... Uh, the the 3D print is way more fragile than what we're going to do. So it should be fine. Oh, crap. That shouldn't have been a death. I don't know that I've ever seen any... any uh, no, I take it... Je Jesse got through this the other night, yeah, last week. I tried like 15 times to get through this level. Ah, crap. Uh, are you going to make it? <laughs> oh, crap. I keep going too far on that. Oh, my. Ah. <laughs> it's so close when you get there. You got to, like, you got to get give it a split second before you start running. Yeah. Hey, did you want to commentate? Uh, yeah, sure. That doesn't matter. Yep. Fuck that guy! Because <laughs> <laughs> he skipped your level, right? Yeah. A very stale pretzel. <laughs> and it <laughs> uh, Spooey's asking what's the next uh, design. We're either going to go with something out of Steven's book. I don't think it'll hear me. Uh, design for what? T shirts? No, the, no, the toys. I'm assuming. That's what he's talking about. We're doing. Uh, oh, you got your own logo in there? It's not even text anymore? 
We all had logos made. <laughs> Crap. Well, we, the ones who submitted it. Like, there's mine. I made Wyatt's. Oh, uh, okay. So, yeah, I'll just do that now. But yeah, it's, but it's gonna, it, w it won't be for the arcade. Crap. The next one. It'll just be something random. You're right, Neon Nightmare. Gravity Man has gone crazy with stage design. He didn't even say goodbye. He didn't say thank you for the gift. That son of a bitch, Wyatt. I'm gonna find you, Wyatt. No. <laughs> I like justice real quick. Where'd this come from? That is Jesse's personal collection. Be very careful. It's the only town there's in the world. Really? Yes. Very, very rare. He has a uh, Christmas. This one too. Be very careful because it's not in a box protector. Yeah. The cards light up and you get a sexy picture of a girl with it. <laughs> a girl. Yeah. See you next year, Neon Knight Rider. Be sure to check you out. Uh, we'll oh, we'll, have, we'll definitely have some surprises for you. Uh, come back on our. And remember, everyone, we're skipping next week and we're heading to uh, New Year's Day. Will be uh, January first, twenty fourteen. Will be the next airing. And uh, if all goes well, we should have some surprises for you guys. So yeah, thanks for checking it out. It's quite a challenging game, but it's also very, uh, he only gets one flip with this thing, too. Yep. He has to fall down, jump, flip there, jump, and then and then just go the rest of the way upside down. Yeah, oh, man. Whoops. Ah! Yeah. Jesse, uh, Spooey, they will be numbered up to 11. <laughs> 11. The rarest number of them all. Only one shall be named 11 and come with a special prize. 12 teen is not as cool, but 11 makes sense. Ah, crap. I remember hearing a kid count in grade school like that. It was killing us. He was like, 9, 10, 11, 10, 12, 10, 13, 14. <laughs> we were like, 11 teen? <laughs> Scarily enough, he went on to become an accountant. <laughs> so you got $11 million? What? <laughs> get, get off the money. You're done, son. Get off the money. <laughs> yeah. Well, like, I heard that. I heard somebody won it. There's been one winning ticket for that $500 million Super Lotto package, which, oh my God, like, you're a target now the rest of your life. There's no way I would tell anybody about that crap, ever. But even if they want it, there's no way they're gonna get they're gonna take the paycheck every year because it's only a hundred thousand dollars a year, so they'll pay you. So what instead they'll do is they'll get the lump sum, which means they automatically cut it in half, the two hundred twenty-five million, and they take like thirty or forty percent after that, and they still have to pay income tax on it. <laughs> oh yeah, so he's a poor baby, he still gets like a hundred eighty million dollars. But I still would never tell anybody I had it. Oh my god, if you had that money, forget it. I'm like hey guys, you wanna go out and have like a dinner? Yeah, you paying? Well no, why not? Like exactly, let's find out exactly. John Michael progressing to Jacob's Ladder, which is level 7. This is the farthest we've actually gotten in this game. Because the second part of the stage, you actually have... And the hard part about this is, he actually, what he has to do is, he has to jump just below that tile right here, and then bounce up, but bounce up correctly here, and then jump across, then do the whole thing upside down. Yeah, this is... He's talking about uh, Spooey wants uh, uh, Day One Edition. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> the X-Bone. Wait a second, I got an idea. Hold on. Oh, we lost Blind Lemon 4. He, he took off. So stay, uh, thanks for sticking with us. Uh, Deacon17, Rizio, uh, Gwonam, was it MyCon? Yeah, MyCon, Neon Knight Rider, Spooey Vision, and Saliva. Sticking through the whole thing. Even though Zalina has not talked at all, it must be, he must be naked running around. There we go! Now John Michael has to do it upside Hold down. On. Okay, Hold on. <laughs> he doesn't want to hear He doesn't want to hear us. He wants to cut the oh, wait, wait, wait! 
John Michael is going <laughs> to do it upside down. Oh! Just when he had it. Yeah, I know. It reads you in some states it kept private. Not that lady in Florida. When she won that, like, $250 million, they, in Florida, they actually announced who she was. Because they have to. So uh, did anything happen to yeah, her? Yeah, she moved the fuck out real quick. Yeah? I would, too. My God. They, I mean, th everything changes. Your family, your friends. I mean... <laughs> It, you just get nut jobs calling up, coming on your front lawn. Give me ten thousand dollars, I'll kill myself. And how can you prove it? He didn't sexually harass me. All. I mean, just just nut. It, it's yeah. Wow. Because it's worth more to pay them off and tell them to go away than do. I wouldn't do. Yeah, it's just crazy. You'd know though if I won the lotto, because everybody would be getting stupid shit. <laughs> like really stupid shit. Like you guys would all be having a funny time, laughing, and then like you'd be like, why is there like a camel in my front yard? <laughs> and it's like and a camel that you can't return. Like, he's got, like, a Sega Saturn logo spray paint on it. Like, what the f***, you know? <laughs> yeah, and you're just like, I don't know what to do with this. <laughs> or, like, a Nintendo World Championship cart, like, on the back of an elephant. Like, you're like, I, uh, but they're, like, a package deal. <laughs> you're like, I want the cart, but... I, r I remember one year some friends of mine were, uh, and I were joking about if we were rich, um, we'd want to pull, like, really ridiculous pranks on people. Like, like, um... Like, we thought that we would buy a car and just take the en engine out and just leave it somewhere where we know that cars get, get s stolen and um, put, like, a um, what looks like a, a box of a current-gen video game system in the front seat, you know? Yeah. And uh, just wait for them to get in there and put, like, a, like a mechanism to where when they open the box, it just, like fills the cabin with glitter or something, and then, like, a camera, like, like, a, like a picture gets mm -hmm. taken stuff like that, or we would uh, get some really elaborate cakes made and fill a van wet with them and just drive through south somewhere and throw cakes at people. Like, <laughs> it looks in the chat right here. Looks like John Michael got assassinated. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> feet in the ground. Just, yeah. yeah. Bunch of chairs, no body. Awesome. Yeah. Yeah. See, exactly. Hey, did another twenty thousand dollars on you sometime? I would. You know, what I would do, Stewie. Uh, just just because I had, like, he had like two hundred fifty-five million dollars. Who gives a shit? You're gonna make it back in interest in a month anyway. I mean, the monthly interest on those accounts, um, because like, I think what a normal bank interest is like four point five interest rate, uh, of what your savings would be. But on millions of dollars, they have to give you. I think it's like sixteen percent, fifteen to sixteen percent minimum. Really. Depending on every ten million you have in there, it's something ridiculous like that. So if I have like a couple hundred million, I, I believe in certain high-end banks, it's like twenty percent interest rate. So if I got Two hundred twenty-five million. Do you think I give a shit about twenty thousand dollars? No, I would actually send you twenty thousand dollars, Stewie. But I would send it to you all in pennies, <laughs> <laughs> or if not pennies, I send it to you in pesos. Oh, oh, oh! It's right there. Oh, god damn! Sorry, that was just so close. I was sending it like, an, oh my god, I didn't care anymore about that joke. That was. <laughs> we were never seen besides this part. Oh man. Erizio actually said he's beaten this level a few weeks ago. Yeah, this is the one we're all stuck at. I believe there's only... This is level 7. There's only a few more levels after this. We knew the second we fired this game up, we were like, this is a John Michael game. Oh. Now, you know what I do, Stewie? I would send you every single copy I could find of Super Mario Bros. Duck Hunt. <laughs> <laughs> Millions of them. No, I fucked that. And Sonic the Hedgehog 06 uh, on Xbox 360. The worst Sonic game ever. And uh, Shaq Fu. And <laughs> 20 grand of the worst games ever. Mid condition. So you can't ever copies of like the worst Commodore 64 game. No system, just the game. <laughs> Actually, <laughs> he'd be evil with that money. You buy every Xbox One ever. So people <laughs> could never have them. <laughs> and then just destroy them. Just keep destroying them. Yeah. I mean, yeah, you'd lose millions. On, on a live stream. Just do a live yeah. stream where you're just destroying... Sony forever! <laughs> <laughs> Nintendo! I said Nintendo to ten million dollars ago, for the love of God, get back on track, guys. Come on. I saw the new Nintendo Direct. Man, it's just lame. Rosaline from Mario Galaxy is going to be a playable character in Smash Brothers. I'm like, great, another princess. Oh, really? Yeah, pretty good. And then they showed this new thing called an NES Remix, which seemed really awesome until it was like a downloadable game. I was like, oh, there they go. we're going to take a bunch of NES classes and give you like one level each. Yeah, John Michael did it! All right. Here's a level. Oh, oh, shit. Look at this bullshit. Timing is everything. He's got to flip in the middle and flip the top. Oh, wow. Take it. 
It seems oh, like is all out. you have to do yep. is get it figured out once. Can you jump into that middle then flip? I wonder how high you can jump. Probably not that high. Oh, so close. You have two you flips. Have, have to flip in the. Oh, he yeah, got it. Go. One flip. John Michael. Win it! John Michael just beat you. Uh, uh, that means that's a win in his book. Oh man. I, I think him and Brett are now tied up again, right? It's what? They're both tied. 35 wins. John Michael's 35 and zero, and and Brett is 35 and one. So well, he did take down. If I, if I took down this game for everyone. Yes, he did. Well, now we well, we still got some time here. Man. We can do some other D games. We're not gonna be able to play. We can play a game with Double Dare. A Double Dare. Yeah, I think we've done it before. I have to go. Oh, John Michael's like fucking I'm out. Oh. <laughs> I beat one game for you all today, so I'm happy. That's to eight. Spoo is right. That's ten games completed. Tonight. Oh, that's we come back, Spoo, we're going to do 16. Me and John Michael are just going to tear through a man. <laughs> uh, let's, hold on, let me, let me hear it real quick. So that is, I want to flip the sky. I actually did not, um, I had not played that in a while, so I'm actually surprised they did as well as I did on that. Um, we're trying to get some other people over here. <laughs> yes, Double, ja double Dare is complete junk. We've done Double Dare, though. Um, hmm. I think what other D games could be played. Hey, Daniel. Yeah. Hypothetically, you want to do versus mode on Double Dragon? Don't play Double Dragon, but do the versus mode? Yes, you might have a tournament or something like that. Oh, okay. Sorry, I was trying to get something going. Um, right now, um, Daniel's trying to get something. Well, we got, we got Defender, Defender 2, and... Uh, Dig Dog, What can be beaten in... Yeah, is there any Christmas hacks we have over there? Ah, uh, you know what? That's a good question. Let's find out. Oh, don't load that game. Is it a bad game? Start loading uh, double Dragon Warrior 4. <laughs> yeah, I don't think we can pull Dragon Warrior 4 off in time. Because I'm basically, um... Sign it off for, um, well, yeah, ten minutes. We might as well finish him off. But this is the 50th episode, so, um, I was actually trying to get everybody, um, has ever been involved with, um, Arcade Legacy's Beard. I tried and have a little interview session, but, um,. Why are you, why are you watching? <laughs> oh, turn this on! Oh. I thought this said Christmas Mario Brothers. Instead, it censored Mario Brothers. There is a poo block, and I just gotta show you this real quick, everybody. Look at Mario. <laughs> what the frig? Those are toilets. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. We have to keep playing this until we see every character in this game. <laughs> oh my god, it's actually kind of. Like, there we go. Uh oh. The just toilets are about to wake up. Yeah, it's just about to get <laughs> censored Mario. Another, another toilet bowl there. Because I think they're another enemy, but um, not. Hit my poo block. Oh, the toilet's got oh, blue. Now it's Tidy Bowl. It's Tidy Bowl. Tidy Bowl's pissed. Come on. Come on, Tidy Bowl. 
Come on. Uh-oh. 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 It's a poo, uh -oh. Uh -oh. It's a poo flame. Poo. <laughs> Why is Mario Simpson? It didn't say Castlevania 6 in here, too, which cracked me up. I messed this up already. Whatever. No, you're still doing it already. Yeah, right. I, I can, yeah. No! Point nice. two seconds of, of nice. Sensor Mario. <laughs> it's just so stupid. Perfect! Perfect! Alright, so I think it's the turtles this one. Oh, it's a plunger! Oh, it's the crab. The crab's the plunger. Oh, I got no poo block. I used up all poo. Alright, uh, that's enough of that. Go ahead and splash it up real quick. I'm gonna put on something else. I wanna see, uh... Uh... I did see Castlevania 6, since we are the Castlevania champions known in this place. <laughs> By the way, that run on, the run on Alucard was really impressive. Oh, thanks. Uh, I watched that and I was like, holy crap! Versus me going, God damn it, I'm off the holy water! <laughs> I, was just, I just wish I'd gotten... I wish I'd gotten Dracula. I didn't that a lot better because oh, otherwise, better otherwise the run would have been completely awesome. Minus the one death, it would have been completely awesome. I love what the guy in Game Facts said. Someone was like, "Why did you choose the harder path of of uh, <laughs> of um, Cypher?" I'm like, "I thought Cypher was easier." <laughs> That's what I thought. That's what I said on there. I just said it was. He said Alucard was harder, and I was complaining, and I'm like. No, it's not really. I thought it was the harder path. I'm like, hey, hard as a pain in the ass. Well, well, I certainly made it look like it was the easier path, that's for sure. Yeah. Uh, but the thing about Cypher is that when you get to later levels, you have to go up the stairs with the stinking um, um, pillars that shoot fire, and that's what makes it so stinking hard. I am not seeing any... Oh, wait, Super Santa Brothers? Could that be the same game? There's a Christmas one. Bad header file, of course. Uh... Some of these hacks don't work exactly right. I did see Super Sperm Brothers. <laughs> <laughs> or Super. We played Super Wheelchair Brothers one night. <laughs> was, he's in a wheelchair. Around. Yeah, yeah. We're, we're in, we have no shame here. Uh, we got Super Star Wars, Super Stick Brothers, Super Sperm Brothers, Super Snow Snow Brother Brothers, Super Punk Brothers, Super Pimp Brothers. Uh, Super Super Brothers. Come on. I'm, I'm desperately looking for a Christmas themed game. Super KKK. I don't so, think that's a good one. So while, while we're here, just because I did want to get some part of an interview about the stupid series, um, how did you get started in uh, Beer Die Trying? Uh, Jesse told me about the idea when uh, before we started it up, and I literally was like, he's like, yeah, let's go. I was like, yeah, he's like, you be into that? I said, hell yeah, I'll be into that. And then it ended up being uh, the first episode was literally me starting it out with 3D World Runner <laughs> by myself. And I was like, I can do this. And I was also the first guy to play. I, I commented it by myself. And I was the first fail, which unfortunately that stream is gone, but that's a good thing. Because you can watch me play level 8 for an hour and a half. Oh. Going, I was like screaming German and cursing in every language I could think of. So angry. And then I just started, I kept coming back each week to commentate more and more. And then Wyatt came in and Jeff and you. And uh, what was the first game you played? I played Alpha Mission. That's yeah. I, I don't think I was there for that. I remember. I remember the first time I saw it was Amagon. You came in and it was Amagon. The infamous Amagon. Now you're gonna And then John Mike was like, "Yeah, let me give it a go." <laughs> I was like, I was like, like ser seriously, seriously. I have just come to, for those three games, and that was it. If I if I had left it at that and just said, "I gotta go home," I'm like, think I that would have probably been the end of me right there, just because. <laughs> It was just like, it was a fun little thing to do, and then I played Amagon, and I beat Amagon, and then all of a sudden you guys kept talking about it over and over again, so I was like, maybe I should keep doing this on a more normal basis. Yeah. Little did I know it would start, like, being this, uh, I have to beat everything kind of thing without a, with a perfect record kind of deal. <laughs> okay, we'll put this on for a second. Okay. This is the Mario 2 hack. I think we just should play Double Dare. This is Super Fucked Up Brothers 2. <laughs> what? Please pick up an enemy. All right, Please pick up uh, an enemy. Uh, oh, they just... Okay, so they just says, fuck. I love using Toad in this game. Yeah, let's pick up... Yeah, let's, let's uh, pick up... Uh, 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 it's just that it says F. That's stupid. I wonder if you use a Kapow if it does something special. 
Probably, because POW is OP as shit in this game. I guess it's supposed to be like a big glitch, like everything's messed up. Let's ride the wind, baby! Oh, yeah! <laughs> <laughs> I love doing that! I love that clip! I'll flash it up real quick. I love doing that in that game. That's why, right. I was the first time I told my friends, like, the only way you can get past the log is you gotta make sure you hit it and go to the ceiling. He's like, really? He kept dying over and over. He's like, this game sucks! I'm like, dude, you, it kills you. Oh, yeah! <laughs> I love that clip. That's right. I was the first time I told my friends, like, the only way you can get past the log is you gotta make sure you hit it and go to the ceiling. He's like, really? He kept dying over and over. He's like, this game sucks! I'm like, dude, you, it kills you. Uh, would you let it, who, you want to, cause you're already here, I mean, what, 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 how much time we got left? Uh, three minutes. Three minutes? Get over here, we'll play a game of Double Dare. Okay. Uh, we need another controller for John Michael. Is there another one down there? Back there. There was one right over there. Uh, alright, let's just... Is there not one over here now? Uh, I don't know. Uh, I guess because, uh, he was brought his, um... Oh. But put up Double Dare and I'll see if there's a controller over here. There is not a controller over huh. here. Would you be a, a, a favored run to the front real quick? Would you want to get into the controller real quick? Where? Oh, it's on the side. Oh, I didn't see it. There is another one. Come on back, John Michael. Sure. We just can't see. Damn glasses. <laughs> All right. Okay, give me number one. We are trying to reach as much as possible here with the cords. Yeah. Get on the stream, sir! Get over that monitor! <laughs> Do your part. Stop looking at porn! No, I'm kidding. <laughs> oh, that's not cool. Okay. Two players. Two players. You can't make me get that up. Easy? Yeah, easy. We gotta get going. Okay. Go. <laughs> Just use your initials. Wait a sec. E, D, E. Alright. Alright, uh, I'll just use DB for Daniel Berserk. Yeah, no, I want that new character, yeah. Oh, I got the ugly girl. Whatever. Here we go. Double dare, baby. Oh! That is true, Arizito. Did that go in there? Didn't go in there. Get the mother. Yay! Shout oh! Michael takes the early lead. Yeah, I win ten dollars. We should just try and get as many physical challenges as possible. Oh, uh, so we just do physical challenges? <laughs> yeah, go back and forth. Okay. Or go to dare. <laughs> it's a paradactyl! Where the P is silent because that guy was a douchebag. And everything is quiet now. So quiet. Hornosaurus! That's the name of, if you don't know, Crash Adams' uh, hair metal band over there. It's his favorite band, Her Hornosaurus. Oh, it's oh, Triceratops. Oh, I didn't even read the question. I just saw Dinah's choice. And here's my physical here's challenge. physical challenge. Trampoline bounce. Just go, man! Ah, he's got a set of human being on a trampoline! Oh, he breaks his coccyx! Oh! Ow. Oh. Oh, John Michael! Yeah. Yes. Damn what the hell! <laughs> you're wanting me to lose. Bite me! I might have. Well, yeah, it's a competition. I may have to answer a question now. <laughs> and now I'm answering the questions. Now I don't trust you in answering. No, we got. We'll just go keep doing physical challenges. I don't care. Well, that means I. We'll see if this is a sly trick. I don't even know which is even quicker. Like, well, I don't know how to answer the question more wrong. Like, will it go faster? I don't know. King Midas! King, King Midas spun straw into gold. Double dare! John Michael's taking on the physical challenge. Whoops. Oop. Okay. Physical challenge! Here we go, folks. Okay, here's my physical challenge.
water basketball. So this entire game is just based off the speed and the angle of whatever the hell you're doing. <laughs> well, once you find it, you pretty much have it down. <laughs> You're like screwing each other, Michael. I thought it would be like more two players if they answer the quiz show. I'm just going to answer the question and get this crap over with. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, I take that back. <laughs> How many bones do we have a cat skeleton? I don't know. I don't care. Why is that knowledge? Like, who needs to know that? Oops. Oh, oh. The correct answer is 206. 230. Who gives a shit? Uh, Everybody needs to know that. Let's go. Oh, yeah. no, no, you get the money. This question is worth $10. How in the hell? Oh. Now I'm just being a spoil sport. <laughs> I just want to get this uh, next question is ten dollars. John Michael is a hanger of the horrible aficionado, it seems. I, I know these questions. These are off the eighties too. Yeah, I know, so if I lose any of these I uh Trimbromaniacs? Oh, oh. I gotta steal! What? Why is he gonna get correct answers? Faster than me! Tempromaniacs. <laughs> so, neither thing is the money. That's ah, a bunch of horse shit. Yeah, I finally had to answer a question. Here we go, folks. It's my rise to ascension. <laughs> <laughs> Why? Dang you. Yeah, I got ten bucks, man! I'm a contender. Come on, you better get to the sucker. Which instrument is the person in the kitchen of the showman? Uh, it wasn't a guitar, it was a harp. A banjo? It's Redneck! Banjo! It's Redneck. Yay! He's still got a $110 lead, but I'm coming back. Slowly but surely. I wonder how many questions they ask you before you go to I was, like, wondering about that. Visit the Acropolis. Dare! I know what it is, but I just, I just want to get to a game. The questions are boring. John Michael has an NPC worth $100! Here, I'll let you try and do a All physical right. challenge. Double dare! The funny thing is, the guy who used to host this show is... Mark he, Summers, yeah. it's OCD. Yeah, he was like freaking out after every single show. Like I can't this. imagine working on a show on Double Dare and being OCD. So here we go, my physical challenge. Yep. I'm not even going to read it. Yeah, I get it. It's Athens, Greece. Come on. Whoops. Whatever. Spaghetti shoot. Yeah, I get it. I got to hit shit. Let's go. Yeah. There. There it is. Winning shot. Oh! <laughs> I got it! <laughs> oh! Too much. Hit the middle ball! I got a little more pee. All right. Oh my God. Oh. Oh. And now the kid has brain damage. I know. I shot him in a meatball. And he. D <laughs> They're all pissed off. Like, God damn it. It's like, and I have brain damage. And you get the money. I think you might be making it to the end of this. This is, you know, this really is not as fun as I was expecting it to be. No, 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 no. <laughs> this is why we're doing it now. Get the D's out the way. Oh, that's not so round one. one. Oh, my God. Halftime. Crap. Oh, here we go. Whatever. Yes! I was robbed! 
John Michael went home and practiced this game. He knew it was upcoming. <laughs> I actually did play a little bit of I Wanna Flip the Scrap Visit. Brussels is the capital of what country? France. France. It's a dare! Come on. Come on. Gotta get through all the games. American Gladiators is much faster. Yeah, I know. But it's much more terrible. I can't wait till we get to Monopoly, because I can kill that game with the NES. I played the shit out of it. It actually goes by real Monopoly rules. When you land on a, on a, a place, you have to either. Buy it, if you can't buy it, it goes up for bidding. So everyone can bid. And the game's so quick that way. The second that you get like three things, you build a hotel, you're done. Oh, you chose Belgium? I thought you were going to do the physical challenge. I did do. I did? Oh, here, here we go. All right. Okay, what am I doing? Putty golf. Yeah, this thing, one egg. <laughs> oh, you got to get it up there, and then your partner has to blow it. Hello, partner! Oh! <laughs> oh <laughs> did you do twice? <laughs> Are those the trees from Duck Hunt in the back? Blow, John Michael! Blow! Oh, that is complete utter BS! Oh, look at the disappointment. Oh, she's pissed! Look at her face! She just found out she's, the, she's not the prom queen. Nerd cereal? How many flavors did cereal? I didn't know nerds had a cereal. I didn't know nerds had cereal. <laughs> These questions are definitely from the 80s. As you can tell, we're like, what the f We were playing Jeopardy one of the days, um, just to play something, and one of the questions was, who's the youngest Beatle? John Lennon. He died first. Yeah. And they're like, no, the answer is George Harrison. I'm like, no, he died second. And they're like, <laughs> like they said it was too, like, <laughs> too dark of an answer. I'm like, what? This game was made in 87. Things changed. All right, here we go. Two? That, okay. That's peculiar. Okay, let's see you do a physical challenge. You bastard. Can't be golf egg. Kangaroo match. Catch the banger. Whatever, I don't give a shit. Oh my god, look at this! Oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm a god! <laughs> so, I can catch kangaroos in my crotch. Oh! I'm. Oh! It's a game now! Now? I <laughs> Look at that! Which pair of the two Batemans is. <laughs> Jason and Justine? Oh! John Michael and I are actually in a heated game of Double Dragon! <laughs> double Dragon! Double Dragon! <laughs> double Dribble! Yeah. Double Dare! Double, double Dribble! Double Dribble! Which vehicle did Disney's Absolute Professor fly? I was about to say that. <laughs> I'm taking the lead! Christmas is coming early! This counts as a loss. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> American Academy of Dentistry took a survey and said, how much money a tooth player was supposed to leave at $1? Any parents leave $5 for a tooth? Is an I was about to say. <laughs> what? Was say. They did not take a survey in the 80s. <laughs> it was the 80s. Yeah, you're right. Harry Hyundai. Oh, Harry wow. Hyundai. Harry Hyundai. Make American cars very good. <laughs> yeah, but not not Leo Ford or whatever. <laughs> I hit the wrong one. <laughs> <laughs> I, I went to go. I was like, what? What? Why did you hit that one? I was like, obviously, the wrong answer. I hit A. I was like, here we go. I was like, oh, no. Let's see if I have to get three questions. I doubt they're going to give me three questions. You're like hoping, no. <laughs> Buy me some. Okay, got uh -huh. to, I got to get two more. If he lets me have two more. <laughs> oh, here we go. It's a heated match here, folks. Everyone knows where you were, Fez. Your feet. From Doctor Who, yeah. Yeah. Okay, well, it's going to give me one. It's oh, one God, more. this is close. If he gets one more question, we're tied up. Caribou! Uh-oh! Am I going to the top? 
We'll find out. Oh. Oh. Yeah! Oh, no! Now oh, you have to do the physical oh. challenge. Now the, the punishment should be that John Michael says, I, since okay. I won the game, you have to play the actual end of it. Bastard. <laughs> And you just hit A, B millions of times. Yo, it's, it, no, you gotta hit like, left and right, up and down and jump. It's crazy, you gotta do both. So here we go, folks, here's the end of the Is it basically this to run or something? Sometimes, yeah. Oh. It, goes, it, it changes back and forth. So it's punishment for losing John Michael. I have to try to do this. You have to press up, to, like, you have to go up the jump. It's really weird. Yeah, I have to go between both. Here we go. So left and right there? Yeah. yeah. And then you gotta, you gotta get underneath it and grab the flag. Oh! Okay, he's got the first flag. Alright, hands it off. Oh, run! I, I, the first oh, flag! Oh, run, run, run! <laughs> 45 seconds! Oh my god, this is bullshit. The game's like, you can do it! Fight me! Oh man, oh man. Oh, oh! Excellent slide! Oh! Oh god, 30 seconds. John Michael's on the fourth quarter. Oh, God. Oh, man. Uh, <laughs> I just said, I hit you, Dumbledore. Oh, no. Oh, oh, bye, 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 bye. No. Oh. Suck it. Suck it. Give me up the free. Give me up the you son of a mother's gun. Give it first. Oh, shut up, dude. I can't do it. He's pressing the shit out of it, too. That's the worst thing. He's doing it perfectly. He's going like this as fast as he can. Oh, God! Oh, I'm getting you, son of a bitch! Ah, we lost it! <laughs> hey, you got a stereo, a pool table to watch! <laughs> Bring it over to my house. Total of $350 in prizes! What a good way to end this on a Christmas high note. Christmas is canceled! Bah humbug! <laughs> oh my we god. We already canceled Christmas. Do us a favor, Patch Adams, and splash that up for us real quick. Yeah. So we're going to come over there and say our goodbye. Jesus Christ. What a... Alright, well thanks everybody. Let's see who's still here. So, just, Spooey says, stop humping the mound. <laughs> <laughs> I that game is so crappy at the end there. It is just absolutely ridiculous. Okay. Uh, I think we have to thank everybody that has come yeah. this year. Who stayed, uh... Oh, we can just... Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Okay, yeah. There we go. So you could, Yes, thank you everybody who came uh, for all 50 episodes, how many have been there. Uh, we'll be back. Uh, we've, we've, learned, we've learned many things throughout these first 50 episodes. Our uh, blood pressure's gone up and our bad eating habits. <laughs> but yeah. we will be back, uh, not next week, we'll be back January 1st for uh, some more stuff and some surprises hopefully you're getting done. So thanks everybody for coming out. So once again, who's here? We got Deathan17, Arizio, uh, Gordon, Mycon, Spooey Vision is alive and sticking with us till the end. Guys, I'll have a Merry Christmas and all that stuff, and we will talk to you all later. Take care. Take care.